Hi there. Today I'm going to be giving a review of a graphic novel that I just finished. It's called Imagine Wanting Only This by Kristen Raddick. I really thought that this would be a great primer for adults who are unaccustomed to reading the genre of graphic novels. And I found that her skill in not only mixed media, working with real photographs, and then also her own drawings, really was only surpassed by her ability to really take her personal life and intertwine it and braid it in with her reflections on abandoned cities and ancient time periods. If I were going to give this a review, I'd probably give it a four out of five because she offers a historical perspective that connects the similarities between ancient civilizations and modern abandoned cities and buildings and towns. But that's just the bones of this book, interwoven between the reflections on ancient Egypt and the land of the Incas and contemporary abandoned mining towns is a personal narrative that is not only one of sorrow, but one of introspection and questioning. So many of the images of the empty cities without the pedestrians and the rush hour traffic will resonate with those who've experienced the pandemic lockdowns. And I could relate to the haunting images of the quiet metropolitan landscapes and the empty highways and the feeling of alienation that Kristen really portrays. I want to note that this book was written, be, published before 2017 and before the pandemic. So in, in that way, it's sort of, I would say, a bit mm, kind of prophetic. So moving on, I think the thing that really made this stand out is that this book really doesn't fit any genre. It doesn't fit the genre of you know, you can't, it's not a story. Um, it's part memoir, it's part biography, it's part essay, it's part fiction or creative fiction, it's part history. So it's impossible to fit this into a genre, a specific one. And anyone who tries to do that is going to be disappointed. I recommend this book because it asks the really big questions of why are we here? What will we leave behind? And how will the people? who come after us, remember us. Once again, Imagine Wanting Only This by Kristen Raddick. Enjoy. We have it in the library.